Hello, Nintendo Chit Chatters. I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. Welcome to episode 6 of The Alliance Alive on the Nintendo 3DS. Shoutouts to Atlas for providing me a copy of the game. And last episode, we had to finish up the Living Forest area, and then we went into the pub, and we had to escape through the underground area of the pub to get to safety. Uh, Barbosa and I believe uh, Renzo stay behind, so it's just Azura and Galil with us right now. Stay tuned, a fun episode's ahead. All right, welcome back, everybody. Yes, yeah, so we had to escape through the underground in the pub. Like I said, Renzo and Barbosa tried to hold off What's his name? Batter? And a few of those enemy guards. So we could escape. Dad and Renzo, how could this have happened? Let's get in contact first with Silver Rain at the East Plateau. Okay. Galil? Let's go, Azura. We need to carry on for your old man and everyone else's sake. East Plateau. All right. Let's see here. I guess we'll go... It's going up. Go down this way. All right, I think I see where we have to go. Some, what are those birds or enemies? What are they? Uh oh, are they landing? What was that? I bet Silver Rain just got here. Let's get there quick. All right. Hey, where are you going? Let's hurry and meet Silver Rain. Okay. Uh, this way? We're on the wrong plateau. <laughs> there they are. They must have landed on those um, bird type creatures. Hmm, here they come. We're Galil and Azura from Night Ravens. We're Hellward and Max from Silver Rain. We came to deliver the ornithop ornithopter uh, that Renza requested. It's like it's a traveling device. So this vehicle is what Renzo meant by noisy package. You guys are supposed to go to the North Cape Cave, correct? You'll need this to get there. What are you guys planning on doing, though? We already heard about what happened in Savannah. We have to save all of our friends. The sooner the better. I get it, but you won't stand a chance against them if you just act without a plan. Luckily, we have an idea of what they're going to do next. White and everyone will most likely be taken to the Caged Realm. The Caged Realm? That's what's on the other side of the humongous wall. I don't know what the Beast Folk are getting inside, but it's supposed to be a place where they imprison humans. Everyone's on the other side of that wall. That's a huge wall. Yikes. Several years ago, most of us in Silver Rain were sent over the wall when Badar picked up on our activities. Some of, in, 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 uh, some of us infiltrated by pretending to work with Badar, but then our communication with them was cut off. We stayed on the side to help defend the area, but now we're left in the dark. All that's left in Silver Rain right now are two of us and a few others. I had no idea. Since then, Night Ravens has been helping us a lot. That's why we want to help Free Wyatt and everyone too. The sooner the better. Yeah, we're on the same page as you guys. That's why we want you guys to plan ahead so you don't make any mistakes. That's how you do all that you can to save them. I get what you mean. Am I tripping over the words here? I need some coffee. 
<laughs> By the way, is it really all right for us to borrow the ornithopter? Yeah, that's fine, but the ornithopter can only get you from a higher location down to a lower one. You won't actually be able to use it to fly over the tall wall. Huh. So just glide down, more or less. We'll manage. In any case, we'll head to the North Cape Cave for now. Okay, don't push yourself too hard now. To reach the North Cape Cave, you'll have to fly over the mountain range up north, and then get past the ravine. It'll probably be a tough journey. You'll find our base, the Tactics Guild Tower, on the way. The guild isn't active right now, but you should be able to stop by to replenish yourselves. Thank you so much. We're going to sneak into Savannah and check on the city. We won't let Badar have his way. Make sure not to die so we can meet again. Okay, we'll make sure not to die. All right, we acquired the Ornithopter. That's very cool. So we're heading to this other guild tower as well. All right, let's head to the North Cape Cave, Azura. We'll go there and get the Ark. Once we do that, we might be able to reach the Cage Realm. Yeah. By the way, aren't you tired, Galil? We can stop by the Recon Guild Tower to rest for a little while. I also don't mind heading over right away, though. Okay, so we can ride this actually now. You can flap the wings. That's cool. Oh, that's so cool. All right, we're going to take a little break here at the end. All right, so we can stay. Azora said she wanted to rest, so... And we'll save as well while we're here. That was pretty fun to fly with this thing, this ornithopter. It's awesome. All right, we are saved and re-energized. Go back to the world map here. So we got to head to another tower. Let's see here. And then to that North Cape Cave. We're going to pass by these guys here. And let's go up along the tree line here, I think. He's still chasing us. Look out for water devils. There should be another um, icon here of a tower on the map. I think it's next to the Living Forest, which we can see on the map right now in the upper left. All right, it is Living Forest is red, and here we are. There's a yellow icon there, so we're going to head up here. This is a battle chain, or no? Okay, just one enemy. Ah. Nice. Uh, I don't like those water devils. Stay away. We're gonna go up here. Now we're gonna go up this mountain. See so it winds around a little bit over here. These cliffs are here, so go along them. There's certainly lots of encounters around here, but uh, we're gonna keep running and get to this next tower. Now, I believe they said the tower will be inactive or, you know, pretty much abandoned for now, but we'll see. We're getting high up here for sure. My ears are popping. Okay. Oh, was that the uh, Tactics Guild Tower that Hellward mentioned? Yeah, it has to be. Let's resupply there before heading to the North Cape Cave. Awesome. Tactics Guild Tower. Yeah, it looks empty. That's weird. No one's here. Is everyone gone? Uh, did you hear something from the floor just above now? Let's go upstairs. Or should we? <clears throat> Who's this guy? It's Sorensen. It's been a while since I had a, a visitor. 
I'm Galil, and this is Azura. I'm Sorensen, the leader of Silver Rain. Wait, did you say Azura? Are you Maria's daughter? Yes, I am. Does that mean you're members of Night Ravens? I heard about the Raiden's Felina. Is Wyatt okay? It's a long story. Galil and Azura share what happened so far. Okay, good. It saves some text. I see, that must have been very trying and painful for him. You may have heard this, but none of the Silver Rain members who were taken to the cage room have ever come back. Wyatt isn't one to give up so easily, though. Both Barbosa and Renzo and my allies, too. All of them should still be alive. I believe that, too. Good. Don't lose hope, no matter what happens. That's because we're the last hope for our friends, aren't we? That's right. Now, I know it's not much, but if you're heading towards North Cape Cave, you can rest up and resupply there. Thank you. My scouts should be en route to the North Cape Cave as well. If you bump into them, please help them out if you can. Alright, so we'll keep an eye out for our scouts. But we'll get ahead to the North Cape Cave. Uh, let's see, exit? Yeah. Okay. So I guess we'll head over here. Keep going up. Right. I wonder if North Cape Cave is past his mountain. Alright, Galil, let's fly over there with the Ornithopter. Hold on, Azura. Flying blindly won't get us anywhere. We'll have to fly from somewhere higher than the mountain. But there's no place higher than the mountain. Hey, calm down. There's lots of spots we can use as platforms. Let's fly from one place to another and find the highest point. Hmm, a platform that can lead us somewhere higher, huh? She's scouting the area. I see a cave. Is that where we have to go? Maybe over there? Alright, let's go. Alright, so we're going to fly from here. I guess over to there. But first, I guess we're going to land here. Ah... Uh, enemy encounter. I don't think you can land on that dirt area. Ah, Fiend Claw. Ooh. It does 16 damage to them. To us. I love the active trap move a lot. Alright, what I wanted to do is try flying over here. There's something sparkling over here. Oh, come on, really? I can't land there? Why can't we land there? Oh, there we go. You have to be very specific where you land. Ah, it's the gem. Okay. Now, let's go up here. I wanted us to go to... a little area, I believe. See, there's the cave that we have to go into, right? Ooh, something else is um, here. Oh, come on. <laughs> Just trying to avoid these guys at all costs. Oh, not that guy, oh brother. Whoa! Only four. But it adds up. Nice. These little sluggers are annoying. That's like five enemies at once. We'll take it. Okay. So we have those gems. That was pretty cool. Let's go up here. So I think that's the cave where we have to go. Here's this little uh, cliff area we wanted to go to. Phew, we landed safely. Yeah, this place is pretty high. Is there a spot where we might be able to fly to the other side? Hmm. 
So there's the tower we were just at. We're flying back this way? Ah, oh, okay. How about over there? It looks like we're at a place here. Oh, okay. I know what we have to do, I believe. We're kind of flying from mountain range to mountain range here. To get to a higher spot, it looks like. Alright, we're gonna land. Boom. We're gonna save our game here, guys. Crazy. And we'll continue on next episode, getting to this North Cape Cave. Make sure you guys blast that like button, comment below, and subscribe. The Alliance Alive launches in North America on March 27th. I'm Eddie Ray for NintendoChitChat.com. See you guys back here next time.